see if it fits. It might be tight, but it fits. Nice. That's pretty good to me. Now we're going to come in here and judge for the closet. This is what I was talking about. It was if when I get more wood, I'll put a shelf here and then a shelf here. Everything will be very accessible. On this side, I'm going to put the tires like that. Put the next shelf, fill that up. It's looking pretty good. I'm pretty stoked about this. That looks good. That looks good. This side looks good. Almost done. Two more shelves. Hey, Bambi. Hey, Bambi. Good boy. Let's go. Come on. We're here at Robson Square. That's the free ice skating. This is a pretty rad place to come for a walk. These steps here and that wall there <clears throat> were used as a backdrop in one of the scenes for the interview. Um, it's a pretty funny movie. I worked on that um, in one of the scenes. Uh, I don't know the whole like newsroom erupts and yeah i'm in that scene i'm in the background it's pretty funny it was pretty cool working on that movie though so anyways yeah this is a nice place to come for a walk when you're downtown nordstrom td scotia bank it's the hotel vancouver that is georgia hotel and then the apartments behind it and then this is the courthouse I woke up this morning with my shoulder just aching. I can barely stretch it. I can't move it up and down. I was also snowboarding with a freaking heavy camera. So, <clears throat> I'm assuming it was either yesterday or day before when it was all slushy that, I don't know, I pulled something or maybe there's a nerve that's pinched. This is the courthouse. To me, this looks like from a movie scene. It's so awesome. I don't think I've ever been inside under where that glass is. Down there, that's Broad Street. This is the building that Scotia Theater is, Scotia Bank Theater is in. <clears throat> Anyways, this place is pretty rad. I know it's a small city by, I don't know, but any other standard. I think the greater Vancouver area has about three million people or something but vancouver proper like real vancouver has less than a million people i think i think i'm pretty sure it's something like that i think i've only walked over here once or twice ever maybe more not that i remember though and i don't remember what that tower is <laughs> it's a hotel and residence tower though. Bambi, come on. Let's go, let's go. Hey you, hey you, where you going? <laughs> I don't think he's ever been here, so when he's new to a place he likes running around and sniffing everything and exploring. Typ typical dog though, hey? Up there is the courthouse restaurant. Oh, Bambi's getting aggressive. And there's a patio that comes out and you can, they used to have salsa dancing and different events up there, but it's really nice up there. Um, I haven't been there for quite a, like five or six years. Holy, I didn't realize it was that long. Maybe longer, seven years maybe. Wow, time flies. <laughs> but yeah, tonight I have a night shoot. My call time is nine o'clock. Um, I'm probably going to try and leave my place and kits at around 7, get there early, but we'll see. I'll probably end up leaving at around 7.30. i got to go home, have a shower, shave, make sure my hair is not a puffy afro. Anyways. Hey, Bams. Hey, you. Oh, good boy. Good boy.
I used to come here all the time when I lived downtown. Just to think, to take pictures, to ice skate, to just relax. During the day, there are food trucks on that side. People are sitting on the steps over there eating, on these steps eating. It's really wonderful during the summer also. They cut off that street uh, between Robson and Hornby. And they have um, usually different types of seating there every year. It's a different type. Down here we have the hip hop dancers. And in the summertime, there's no ice rink. It's just concrete. And everyone's just dancing down there. People. Um, Hip hop dancing, break dancing, salsa dancers come there. This is really a great city to just walk around in. I love this place. Oh, looks like Bambi wants to get going. Well, I just finished a night shoot and uh, it was pretty long. We started at 9 p.m. and it is 8 a.m. Um, I wasn't able to obviously edit a video and get it uploaded last night, so on the way home, I'm gonna finish it by making this video, and then I will edit and upload it, and then go to sleep for a few hours, wake up, and go pick up Bambi from Sarah's. I might pick him up this morning if she's awake uh, by the time I get through downtown. Um, we were working in Coquitlam at a mall there, and we weren't doing much. Walking around the mall. There's a stunt sequence. A guy climbs up like an elevator kind of idea, and then he flips over or something. And it's, it's like parkour stuff. It was pretty interesting what he was doing. It seems like a really cheesy commercial, but whatever. That's that's life, right? You, you never know what you're gonna work on. Sometimes it's really cool projects, um, but it's like a super cheesy thing. Or it's a really cool, or it's a really cheesy project, project, but everything's really cool about it. Like the crew is rad, the, every, everything's good, except for that ends up being like the worst thing ever. Or sometimes, you, I don't know, I'm really tired. There's all sorts of scenarios. I've been up for basically 24 hours, um, and I'm driving home. <laughs> but whatever, I'm almost home. I'm like half an hour away, maybe, maybe a bit more actually. Instagram has a new feature where you can have multiple accounts, so I'm super stoked about that. Um, I got Bambi's account on there, Bambi Delazerta, I got my account, um, I have a couple other accounts um, on Instagram. Um, I'm thinking of putting together a website for nestordelazerta.com and then it has all the different projects that I work on and all the different ways to contact me and who I'm working with and all that kind of stuff. I think I should start designing that and put that up on the internet and uh, yeah, start getting a lot more followers for everything. Get some views on these videos for real. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's something I have to um, just start doing. I just have to start doing that. Maybe when I wake up in a few hours, maybe two or three o'clock, I'll start drawing some ideas for website and how I want it to kind of work. Um, I can design HTML pretty easily. The thing I'm not very good at is CSS and all that kind of stuff. And I don't really like using templates and all that for websites. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. But anyways, today was a great day. Um, There's a bunch of friends on set. Talked a lot. Didn't really make any new friends, which is cool. Whatever. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes you do. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. I should, I should show you what this mount looks like. Anyways, maybe I'll do that in tomorrow's video. Hopefully I have enough energy, because I really want to go snowboarding when I wake up. Um, it's starting to rain, and it's getting way warmer right now. It's 7 degrees Celsius down here. That means it's not even freezing up in grouse. But, uh, but yeah. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys in a bit because, uh, yeah, I'll be up in a few hours. Love life.